Hello, fellow alchemists. Welcome back. Uh, I was browsing around Reddit recently, uh, and I saw something very, very interesting. And somebody actually showed how you can actually add coloring to your login. I thought this was really, really interesting, so I kind of want to show you guys this. Uh, I tried looking through the docs. Maybe I missed something somewhere, but uh, I didn't really see this clearly documented. So maybe it's a good idea that maybe go back and document it. I don't know. But in any case, I want to show you guys how to actually do this. So of course, if you're working with a logger, you have to actually require it. Once you require it, then you can, of course, start to actually use it. So initially, if you say hello from the logger, I'm just going to get this kind of simple format, right? This simple style white on black, typical. Now, what you can do is there's a ANSI color that you could use, and you could say something like cyan. And you see now it's cyan. So it's kind of typical as like the debugger, you know, how it all looks. Uh, then, or you can say, uh, there's also, of course, light cyan, really easy to see. A little bit more easier to see, you can say magenta. So you can get this kind of look. Um, now, what else is cool is you can also deal with the background colors. So I believe you can just say magenta background. And now you have this kind of color. So I thought this is really cool because, uh, you know, usually you want to add something like, you know, some capital letters or something. Maybe you can do a command F and try to search for what you're looking for. But now with colors, you can make it even more striking. So you can just kind of look through everything and see what's going on. So maybe you can actually color your error logs a little bit more. Uh, more, you know, out there so you really can catch those errors a little bit easier. Uh, what else you can do is you can actually do this, which is really, really cool. You can actually mix colors. So you can say I want cyan with a magenta background. And you can get that. And I thought that's really, really cool too. So actually, I didn't really need this. I didn't really, sorry, I didn't really see this. I didn't see it documented. It may be documented there. I'm not too sure. Uh, but I just tried it to see if it works, and I thought this was really cool, right? So now you can get some really custom-looking log messages, and I think this is something that is really, really cool, really neat, and I think that this is something that, yeah, as you're debugging or whatever, this would be great to have because it's really, really eye-catching when you're going through. But this is only, of course, going to show up in the terminal, and this is ANSI colors, as you can see. So you need to see if your terminal can actually support that kind of stuff. So, uh, yeah, this is kind of my little tip for the week. And so this is Alan from Pygora. Please subscribe to Heaven Tell Otherwise I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks. Bye.